History of Nokia In the ever-evolving landscape of technology companies, few names have left as indelible a mark on the world as Nokia. For decades, this Finnish telecommunications giant was synonymous with mobile phones, innovation, and global dominance. However, the story of Nokia is not just a tale of success, it is also a cautionary tale of how a company can rise to unparalleled heights and then fall from grace. This comprehensive history of Nokia will take you on a journey from its humble beginnings as a paper mill in the 19th century to its role as a global mobile phone powerhouse and its eventual decline. The Roots From Paper to Pioneering Technology The Nokia Corporation's story began in 1865 in a small Finnish town called Nokia. Frederick Eidstem, a Swedish mining engineer, founded a wood pulp mill in the town, which laid the groundwork for Nokia's future endeavors. The company soon expanded into producing electricity and rubber products, diversifying its operations. However, Nokia's transformation into a technology company was still on the horizon. It wasn't until the 1960s that Nokia made its first foray into the realm of electronics. The company established its electronics department and began producing items like televisions and radio phones. The Mobile Revolution, Nokia's Ascent the turning point in Nokia's history came in the 1980s with the advent of mobile telecommunications. In 1981, the Nordic Mobile Telephone NMT, network, a precursor to modern cellular networks, was launched. This development presented Nokia with a unique opportunity to leverage its expertise in electronics and telecommunications. Nokia introduced its first handheld mobile phone, the Mobira Cityman 900, in 1987. While the Cinnamon 900 was large and expensive by today's standards, it was a game-changer at the time, offering unprecedented mobility and connectivity. Nokia continued to innovate, and by the late 1990s it had produced iconic models like the Nokia 3210 and the Nokia 5110, which became worldwide sensations. The late 1990s and early 2000s marked the peak of Nokia's success in the mobile phone industry. The company dominated the market, boasting a staggering 40% global market share in 2007. Nokia's mobile phones were renowned for their durability, reliability, and user-friendly interfaces. One of the key factors behind Nokia's dominance was its commitment to research and development. The company invested heavily in technology and innovation, leading to the creation of several groundbreaking features, including the introduction of the first mobile phone with an integrated camera, the Nokia 7650, in 2002. The Golden Age of Nokia late 1990s, early 2000s. The late 1990s and early 2000s were the pinnacle of Nokia's success in the mobile phone industry. The Nokia 3310 launched in 2000 became a cultural phenomenon known for its durability and long-lasting battery life. It was during this time that Nokia rose to prominence as the world's largest mobile phone manufacturer, a position it held for over a decade. Nokia's success was not only due to its hardware but also its software, such as the user-friendly and customizable Nokia Series 40 operating system. Additionally, Nokia's diverse product range catered to various market segments, contributing to its widespread popularity. Nokia's operating system, Symbian A significant part of Nokia's success can be attributed to its proprietary operating system, Symbian. Early in the 2000s, Symbian OS, originally created by a group of technology companies, including Nokia, became the preeminent platform for mobile phones. Symbian's open architecture allowed for customization and a wide range of third-party applications, making Nokia's phones incredibly versatile. This flexibility combined with Nokia's hardware expertise made their devices popular among both consumers and developers. Challenges and Competitors While Nokia enjoyed immense success, it was not without its share of challenges. The early 2000s saw the emergence of new competitors, most notably Apple and its revolutionary iPhone in 2007. The iPhone's introduction marked a significant shift in the industry, emphasizing touchscreens and user-friendly app ecosystems. Nokia's response to the changing landscape was somewhat slow and fragmented. The company continued to rely on Symbian, which was showing signs of age compared to newer, more modern operating systems. The decision to stick with Symbian while competitors embraced touchscreen technology would prove costly in the long run. The Microsoft Partnership In a bid to regain its footing in the smartphone market, Nokia entered into a partnership with Microsoft in 2011. Under this agreement, Nokia would adopt the Windows Phone operating system for its smartphones, effectively discontinuing Symbian. The partnership resulted in the launch of the Nokia Lumia series, which received critical acclaim for its design and camera technology. However, despite some positive reception, the Lumia devices faced fierce competition from Apple's iPhone and Android-powered smartphones. The Fall of Nokia Unfortunately, Nokia's partnership with Microsoft did not yield the desired results. While the Lumia series garnered attention, it struggled to gain significant market share in the face of Apple's iOS and Google's Android. 
The decision to abandon Symbian, which had a loyal user base, also alienated some of Nokia's customers. In 2014, Microsoft acquired Nokia's Devices and Services division, effectively ending Nokia's reign as a mobile phone manufacturer. The iconic Nokia brand lived on in other forms as the company continued to operate in areas such as telecommunications infrastructure, networking solutions, and patent licensing. Nokia's Rebirth and New Horizons Nokia's exit from the mobile phone market did not mark the end of its journey. The company refocused its efforts on other areas of technology, including networking equipment and 5G infrastructure. Nokia's expertise in these domains allowed it to remain a significant player in the global telecommunications industry. In 2016, Nokia Technologies, a subsidiary of Nokia, made headlines by announcing a new version of the iconic Nokia 3310, a beloved feature phone from the early 2000s. The nostalgic release garnered significant attention and reminded the world of Nokia's enduring legacy. Nokia also continued to invest in cutting-edge technologies such as artificial intelligence, the Internet of Things, IoT, and cloud computing. These strategic moves aim to position Nokia as a key player in the future of connected devices and smart technologies. Interesting facts about Nokia Nokia, a Finnish telecommunications giant, boasts a fascinating array of historical milestones and unique facts. It began as a pulp mill in 1865, before venturing into rubber and cable production. The iconic Nokia tune, heard on millions of phones worldwide, was composed by Francisco Turega. Nokia made history in 1991 with the world's first GSM call using the Nokia 1011. The company introduced the classic snake game on its phones, becoming a pop culture sensation. The hefty Nokia Mobira Talkman, weighing 11 kilograms, was one of the earliest transportable phones. Nokia is renowned for its extensive patent portfolio and its contribution to global telecommunications standards. The Nokia 8110, known as the Matrix phone, gained fame from the film. In recent years, Nokia has made a comeback in mobile phones through HMD Global. Nokia Bell Labs is even involved in creating the first cellular network on the moon. With a history of mergers, acquisitions, and a focus on sustainability, Nokia's story is a testament to its enduring impact on technology and innovation. Conclusion, Nokia's Legacy The history of Nokia is a captivating tale of a company's journey from humble beginnings to global dominance and ultimately, transformation and adaptation in the face of changing markets. Nokia's mobile phones, once ubiquitous worldwide, play a pivotal role in connecting people and reshaping the way we communicate. While Nokia's reign as a mobile phone giant may have ended, its legacy lives on. The company's commitment to innovation, quality, and resilience has allowed it to remain relevant in the ever-evolving tech industry, albeit in different capacities. Nokia's story serves as a valuable lesson for businesses. Adapt or risk obsolescence. In the rapidly changing world of technology, companies must continuously innovate and pivot to meet the demands of the market. Nokia's journey from paper mill to pioneering technology company is a testament to the enduring spirit of innovation and reinvention that defines the tech industry. As we look back on Nokia's history, we can appreciate the impact it has had on our lives and the way we communicate. From the iconic Nokia 3310 to the groundbreaking smartphones of the early 2000s, Nokia's influence is woven into the fabric of modern technology. It's a reminder that in the world of tech, even giants can rise, fall, and rise again in unexpected ways. Would you like it? Hit the like button and subscribe to our channels for more interesting and informative videos.